Hi everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Sheena and in today's video I am going to show you how to achieve this look. Yes, it's very dramatic. Um, we are in lockdown and we're not going anywhere but we might as well do some creative stuff than just watching TV all day. So if you are interested in knowing what products I've used to achieve this look then please keep on watching so in here I started by moisturizing my face with a moisturizer of course and um, the brand of the moisturizer that I was using was simple if you're not familiar with it I can link it down below on the description box for this video, I am going to use the BLK Cosmetic Stick Foundation. This is a Philippine brand. I've bought this from last year when I went back home. This is in the shade Natural Beige. This stick comes with um, its little brush, the other side of the stick. I did start using them but then it was quite pulling my um, skin a little bit too much so I've um, used this sponge wedge you can buy this from any drugstore I bought this recently from Amazon for about five pounds for about 20 to 30 pieces this is quite nice if you are quite lazy with um, washing your uh, brushes so this can be just disposable you can also reuse them if you want just make sure that you wash them but change them when they're already a little bit you know softer so as you can see I don't really have a pattern on how I apply my foundation I just need to make sure that they are all blended in with no streaks so next one is applying the eyeshadow here I have a Dior um, eyeshadow palette this is from their holiday couture collection sparkling couture palette I am using the middle shade the shade number 664 it doesn't really have a name on the label so I just use one shade for my eyeshadow because to be honest I'm not really good at blending eyeshadows so for safety purposes I'll just use one shade just to avoid that over the top look so for this one I'm just using the lightest shade of the eyeshadow just to highlight the bit just underneath my eyebrows so for my eyebrows I am using the Rimmel's brow this way brow kit this is in the shade dark brown I don't really need to draw on my eyebrows because I do have a good um, amount of hairs on my eyebrows so just filling up the gaps where it needs to be filled in I have to mention that I wasn't using any mirrors when I was filming this video so it was a little bit weird for me to do the makeup by just relying on the camera well the phone camera that I was using so I'm just using a little spoolie here just to blend in the product to my eyebrows just to make it a little even so in here I'm going to use the black pencil eyeliner by YSL just putting them on on my waterline what? 
So in here, I'm going to use a magnetic strip eyelashes set. I got this from Amazon for about £12. It comes with three um, sets of eyelashes. I'm using the metal one, 105, or shall I say 015. It comes with a liquid eyeliner. This liquid eyeliner has a brush tip. So when applying, you have to be very still and very precise so you can have a straight line you have to apply a generous amount of eyeliner so you have to make sure that it sticks together so the eyelash strip will stick into the eyeliner which has a magnetic element into it as you can see, I'm pulling my eyes like that when applying an eyeliner. Most of the professional makeup artists will not recommend to, to do that, but this is how I can apply my eyeliner precisely. Again, just to remind you, I'm not using mirror when I was filming this video, so that's pretty impressive for me too apply that eyeliner the way I'm doing right now so here's the eyelash strip you can actually cut it by the size that you wish for me I'm going to use the whole strip so it's, uh, if you can see I didn't use any glue the eyelash strip comes with little squares of magnets into it and it it just um, stick onto the eyeliner that we applied earlier so I just um, pat it down at this point I had to remove that lashes because I didn't apply it properly so I'm just tapping up and tidying the eyeliner that I applied earlier I'm gonna let it dry for a little bit and try to apply the eyelashes again so I'm gonna start on this side because I felt that it was a little easier and it was already dry so that's it it was super easy to apply Again, this eyelashes is quite dramatic. It's a little long, but it's very impressive the way that it just sticks together because of the magnetic element of both the eyeliner and then the eyelashes itself. So at this point, I wasn't really impressed of the way I applied left hand side eyelashes but any hoo-ha so in here I am going to apply the lipstick from Sunny's face this is in the color major I don't really use brush so I just apply it from the lipstick except from the tip itself to my lip here I'm trying to show you the shade of this lipstick is called Major. The camera is not showing it properly. Again, from Sunny's face. And one last thing to apply is the blush. This is my favorite blush, as you can see. This is from NYX. I just grabbed the brush. This is just a face brush just a tiny bit of blush this is kind of coral color
and there you have it i hope you all enjoy this video if you have any comments or suggestions then please leave your comment down below i would appreciate a subscribe from all of you and grow my page thank you very much for watching and i hope to see you very soon on my next video keep safe stay home and don't be stupid bye